Oh shit, I knocked my shit down already. What's up, y'all? Cleef up in the motherfucker. Hizzy. What's going on, y'all? What's going on with? You know, I'm just chilling. I was got up, right? I was watching the Adult Swims and shit late at night. You know what I'm saying? I like that Adult Swims. I had got up. Actually, I was going to get me some Cheetos. And we broke so we ain't got no Cheetos. But, you know, I wanted some. I like them Cheetos. They them curly ones. Them curly soft ones. They kind of kind of smell like a queef. I like, uh, you know, they smell like my queef because I probably eat them all the time, right? You know what I'm saying? I was going to get some coffee, but... I remember one time me and my mom, right, we was at the store one time, and she had got some coffee, some folders choice or something like that, some cheap, cheap, cheap shit, but I thought it was good, like, fucking cheap coffee, 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 right? No. Anyway, I had, I don't like six cups of this shit. Man, motherfucker had shit, they had me up motherfucking days, yo. I was up for days. I was creeping all over the place, shit, man, me all, I'm like gassy, like a motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? I was all gassy. But anyway. Um, all I want to do is tell y'all a story. I'm going to tell y'all a story. Um, and it's a true story, too. You know, um, what happened was, um, me, you know, because I'm one of them brown skin of quick nails. I told you that, right? So I don't be playing with the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? I don't be playing with none of that crazy shit. I'll be like, getting my shit straight. Uh, strike a queef. Anyway, what I was saying, but we, me and my girls, right? Me and my girl, we were sitting on the side of the road. Like we were like, we were like selling no pussy, right? But you know, if a motherfucker come along and want to buy some of this madness queef pussy I got, shit, it's mine, right? It's mine. I'll sell if I want to, bitch. You know, I, so I, you know, I was gonna do that, but right? But my girls, right? They was over there, and we was talking about uh, how fine motherfucker Bill Clinton was back in the day. You know, he was president back in them days when he was running shit. You know what I'm saying? And he, that was, uh, finer than this motherfucking nigga we got now. Right? I say, no. You know what, find out? You know why he act like he act? You know how he act like he act? He ain't even black, yo. He got, you got to be like 12%, right? 12% black to be black. He's like, I think like 7.2% black. I don't know. I don't really know what that means or nothing, but what I'm saying, I know it means that he ain't no nigga. He ain't even a Negro, yo. So he sure the fuck ain't no nigga, you know what I mean? That's why he act like that. It's gonna be pissing me off. He act like that called, like, he like, um, he like rose up around all these white folks and shit, right? That's why he you know, is white like he is, you know? He whiter than a motherfucking white dude. I wish I could get with one of white dudes with that, that stuff they got in them, you know what I'm saying? Um, good stuff, man. That's like falling to my race. I don't know. I can't remember the name of it again. <laughs> I'm so sorry. What about my hair? Oh, Lord. I dropped my goddamn goose down. My money goose down here. Can't do that. Anyhow. Anyway, they would start speaking, right? And they was talking to me. But they was talking in tongues, right? Because they had just come from church. And they was with Jesus. He had us speaking in tongues. Right? I was like, what the fuck you talking about? Well, he said, man, you come and speak in tongues. He got you speaking in tongues. You come up in there uh, in Pentecostal. So I, got, I said, motherfucker, make me speak in tongues. I'll whoop his ass. I speak for me. Queef, I do the queefers. That's all I need to do. I don't need to be speaking no tongues. Motherfucker jam speaking in tongues for Jesus. Fucker Jesus. Little Mexican motherfucker lived down on 72nd Street. Little punk motherfucker. You know what I mean? He stole my motherfucking rims. Three of them at least. Left the last one there, right? I ain't gonna steal three rims. So I did what I had to do, right? I just took my other rim. I took it to the pawn shop. To my daddy and then my daddy and made it into this like this necklace for me. It went around my neck. And I um, I had wore it, right? For um, my Auntie Cheryl. My Auntie Cheryl's wet, but she got married. And it was for her marriage proposal. Well, actually, it was the marriage, the wedding is what I bought too. I look good too. Queef was sweet and boy, had my queef necklace. It was like a diamond shaped queef necklace on. I was pumping, boy. Motherfucker, shit was right. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, that's why he act like that. Um, Obama. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker, he he act like that called. You know, I was watching the news and all, right? I didn't really understand what was going on. I just, I just figured out brother was a brother. You know what I mean? I learned my lesson now, then. Ha! Ah! Motherfucking Bill Clinton. Now, I was a nail president, like I said. Shit. You know? Anyway, we were speaking in tongues. They were speaking in tongues. 
and we go like blah 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 Oh, you know what happened? I caught the spirit of the Lord in my pussy hole. And I creeped out a holy creep. <laughs> right in Jesus' face, yo. That little Mexican motherfucker had been down there right trying to get in some of that good creep. creep coop, and I blow the madness creep right in his face. Saved his Lord life. Saved his soul with my creepness. He jumped right out the car, right, and ran over there and got his motherfucking hoopty ass little motherfucking goddamn low ride and bullshit, right? And he ran the fuck off and went home and ate a motherfucking Ferrito, yo. Motherfucker. You know. But anyway, uh, what I was trying to get to was like this. I was looking for this song, and I found it on a CD. I'll go more about the CD later. But I can't remember the name. It ain't on the CD. It's like a, that Three Dirties three Down, that CD. You know what I mean? That song is like, like, If I could be like that, yo, I'd give a nigga everything in my shoe. You know what I'm saying? Like that. It ain't on my CD. They said it was going to be on. It's all signed and shit, local CD. It's going to be on the Eba Bay, yo. I'm going to put this on the Eba Bay. Shit. 